Mark Malman has been doing music here in the Twin Cities for over 20 years, writing it, playing it, doing a great job, releasing albums, touring. And now Minneapolis mus musician Mark Molman is also an author. He is telling his story of healing and optimism in a memoir called The Happiness Project. And I know you've been here before, but it's so nice that you're here on this Saturday morning, on this chilly Saturday morning, yeah. to talk about this fabulous book. So congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. So The Happiness Play the Happiness Playlist yeah. is an actual playlist, which yeah. is awesome, mm -hmm. that you can download and listen to it but it goes may, way deeper than that. Mm -hmm. Why did you want to write this book and why did you think this was so important? I didn't, I didn't know I was going to write a book. I'm just so used to writing albums and touring and in the loop and keeping the lights on, the rent paid. And um, something happened to me where, it, where I was getting panic attacks and anxiety and I started making a playlist on Spotify of songs that I could put on and pull me out of it. And it worked so well, a year later, a year and a half later, I was like, I'm gonna write a book about how well this works for me. Because it, it, it was day-to-day -day activities, you know, not my unique career as a musician, but you know, things that everybody goes through, uh, you, you know. And we all know that depression and anxiety and stress is such a huge thing for so many people in many different, different levels. levels. Yeah. And yours was at three o'clock in the morning, you woke oh, up. Yeah. <laughs> that's, I mean, that's how your book starts. Yeah, mm -hmm. it starts with a weird panic attack that didn't go away and is and I I pulled myself out of it you know and this book starts a year later after all the all the kind of um, wrestling I did to balance to balance my life so it is ingrained in you music's been a part of your life your yeah. whole life and you realize what the power of it is yeah. but for everyone else it is amazing how powerful music is and how it can change not only just your outward appearance, but your inward feelings as well, right? Absolutely. I mean, it, it, if you think about um, how prevalent it is in our lives, what do you do after work? You get in the car, you crank the music, mm -hmm. and you release all your stress from the day. You wake up on Saturday morning, the first thing you do, you put on music. You, you don't even think about it because it's ingrained in all of our lives. I was reading your blog this morning. I was looking at the playlist, which I love so many of your songs that you've, <laughs> that you've chosen. And I want to they quote uh, Craig Finn, who is uh, the front man of a critically acclaimed band, The Hold Steady, which, of mm -hmm. course, um, you're part of. The Happiness Playlist is funny, thought-provoking, and just plain helpful. It's the best book on grief that I've ever picked up. The examination of music listening as a method to combat heartbreak is a joy to read, and you need this book. Congratulations. I mean, there's so many of these in your blog, and I so, I so appreciate it. I was reading it last night, mm -hmm. and I am so on your page of what you're talking about here, and I think it's going to help me, and I'm going to for sure download this playlist. Yeah, you can find it on Spotify, <laughs> and I hope it helps people. You know, I think it will. Thanks. I think it will. And how? And music still moving along really good for you. <laughs> it's and great. I mean, I, 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 I love it, you know, and it, it helps me... Um, this listening to music uh, and writing about the idea of listening to music as opposed to performing and creating has changed my perspective on how um, it affects the body. You know, it, it find music that bypasses your brain and makes you dance. And that dancing will affect your happiness and you can go on and fight your struggles, you know. Oh, that's, yeah. I really appreciate you coming on. And there, on your website, it tells all of your appearances and also talks about what you're doing at the Minneapolis Public Library, which yeah. is phenomenal as yeah. well. We don't have time to talk about that right now. I wish we did. <laughs> Mark That's Malman's, in May. Okay, thank you. That's in May. Mark Malman's new book is called The Happiness Playlist. He has a number of upcoming events, as I mentioned, and it is all on the website. So go to carolevin.com and you can find this book all over the place, right? Yep. All over the place. <laughs> Check it out. It's great. We'll be back in just a couple of minutes.